Hey gems, welcome back to the channel, Crystal Heart. My name is Crystal and today we're opening the Jolly Box. All right, y'all, before we get into this Jolly Box, y'all don't forget to hit the thumbs up button. And if you're not subscribed, go ahead, hit the subscribe button and that little bell notification so you're notified every time I post a video. All right, y'all, the time has come for the 2023 Sh Jolly Box by Fat Core Shop. I am so excited. This box is huge. It's like way bigger than they usually are. It's super cute with the little stockings and peppermints and candy cane. But okay, I cut the tape. I haven't opened it up yet to see what it looks like. I'm out of breath because I literally ran to the mailbox and ran upstairs to record this. All right, so it says 2023 Jolly Box, tis the season to be jolly. Fat Core Shop exclusive. All right. And the coupon on here is 20% off Christmas fabrics. All right, y'all. Oops, something just went flying. We got a little paper. I'll go over this at the end. What went flying was this charm. It's a candy cane with a bow enamel charm. It is really cute. I guess you could use it like for a scissor fob or just on your keychain decoration for Christmas. Whew, all right. Oh, wow. Things. What is this? Cracker de Noel. Okay. Oh, look how cute how it opens. That's cute. What is in here? All right, we have some hand sewing needles. Oop. <laughs> hand sewing needles by Bowen. Uh, size three and nine. Sharps. Which, oh, and some little pins, bow-in pins. I don't know if I've ever used these pins before. I'll give them a go. But I'm really into my magic pins right now. And I love hand sewing needles because I do a lot of hand sewing. All right. So this is the fabric. And it is Holiday Cheer, Raleigh Blake. Holiday Cheer by My Mind's Eye. All right, so we have the gingerbread. This is how I'm decorating my house for Christmas this year. And these are, seems like fat quarters. Yeah, fat quarters, eight fat quarters. The red. Then we have the little stockings. The Christmas trees the text cheer noel merry bright oh this is cute with the wreaths and the presents oh this is kind of cute santa all in the red and white and then the polka dot which is cute all right and then we also have quilt as you go jolly gingerbread pot holders uh now with go die cutting instructions. Oh, it has a little gingerbread men and the little pot holders. Now we just did a swap in my Facebook group for Crystal Heart with pot holders and trivets. But I would actually make these just for the fact that they have the theme of what I am decorating for for Christmas. So that I would actually make that. And then, oh wow, we have a whole roll of Aurifil. Uh, what color is this? I don't know, uh, 2605? 50 weight. I use, I use um, gray thread for everything. So this is something that I would get some good use out of. i rather the lighter gray, but I would use this as well. And then we have a pattern. It is the Christmas candy dish quilt pattern. 
And it's all these, it matches the little charm that I already lost. It matches the charm. All right, so for this, you would need um, the Fat Quarter Bundle. You need two and three eight yards of background and borders, which is the blue. I like that it's on dark background. You need a fat quarter of white uh, fabric for accent. I'm assuming these. I don't know. I might be wrong. Five eight yards for binding. And the quilt measures at 52 and a half by 52 and a half. I actually really, really like this as a Christmas quilt. I don't know. I wouldn't make it this year probably because I have other Christmas things to do. But it actually makes a really cute Christmas quilt. And I don't need a million Christmas quilts though. But then what else do you do with Christmas fabric but make a Christmas quilt? All right. So that was everything. Let's look at what this little paper says. Um, so the fabric is valued at $23.98. The needles and the pins valued at $11.48. The pot holder batting quilt as you go, June Taylor, valued at $9.98. Pattern, $9.98 as usual. The thread, valued at $13.98. And the little charm, valued at $10.98. All right, y'all. So what do I think about the box? I think it's a good box. Um, It doesn't like make me get so excited, but... I actually think that I'll probably make these this year. The pattern, I'll probably save for another time. Um, I'm excited about the thread that I just that just flew across the room. I'm excited about the thread because it's useful. I'll probably hook this to my keys for the season. And then the needles will get used. And the pins, I'll try them out. But like I said, I like my magic pins. Uh, I think it's a good box. It doesn't get me all super excited, but I do like it. Y'all let me know, what are your, your opinions? Do you like the box? Did you get the box? Are you going to be looking for it after um, seeing this video? Uh, do you think it's worth it or not? I think the, altogether it was like $54 or something. Like, I, I don't know. Don't quote me. All right. Anyway, <laughs> thank you for watching this video. Once again, hit the like button on your way out. And if you're not subscribed, go ahead, hit that subscribe button and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.